Hi guys, German Prepper here. I have some intel, some news coming out of Germany. The lower house of parliament this last Friday approved the creation of a hundred billion euro. That's a hundred and eight billion dollars special defense fund that our chancellor here, Olaf Scholz, has announced in what he says is a response to Russia's invasion of Ukraine. So this money is destined to top up the regular defence budget of around 50 billion euros over the next several years. And the aim is to rebuild Germany's military, which honestly has been uh, in a state of neglect since the end of the Cold War. Uh, it's not been fit for purpose. So in some senses, this is a good thing. Now, the fund will enable Germany to meet the NATO defence target of spending 2% of its economic output on defence each year. And this is something that President Trump was very keen to see Germany enact. Um, but of course, back then, Trump was bad, they said, and we couldn't possibly do that. Well, now, turns out Trump was completely right, and uh, a war is coming, and we need to rearm as quickly as possible. So fancy that. Now, um, what this is going to mean is... Germany is actually going to be the third largest defence spender in the world. It's going to spend more money than every other country bar the United States and China on its military, even more than Russia. Now, predictably, the Russian uh, thoughts on this development are not good. Let me just give you a quote from them. We perceive the statement of the German Chancellor as yet another confirmation that Berlin has set a course for an accelerated remilitarization of the country. How could this end? Alas, this is well known from history. That's Russian Foreign Ministry spokeswoman Maria Zakharova. I'd love to hear, guys, your thoughts on how you think this is all going to end. Is this Germany just peacefully meeting its NATO commitments? Or is this really the beginning of something far more worrisome. Cheers for now, guys.